hi a very good evening to all of you again and today we have yet again a new story and a new moral to learn so thank you everyone for tuning in and put all your things away and today we have three guests again we have chris we have ayan and we have our special guest yes. anaya so anaya that's a do you want to hear a story about a monkey hmm. okay so let's get set to read a story about the homeless monkey so let's begin the story of the homeless monkey once upon a time there lived a monkey who had no home of his own they called him springs for he always walked with a bounce in his step it would be fun no walking in the bouncing and walking yeah. as if there are springs under your legs yeah. he had sold everything he owned and with that money he had started traveling the world how wonderful it is to be traveling the whole world it's really exciting and amazing he wanted to see the world's smallest and the biggest wonders he traveled from village to village town to town he offered his services to do work in exchange for food and shelter to hum yahan pe dekh rahe hain ki ek monkey hai uska naam springs hai उसका नाम स्प्रिंग्स क्यों है क्योंकि वो जब चलता है तो वो उछल उछल के चलता है जैसे पैरों के नीचे स्प्रिंग्स लगा हो और उसको पूरा दुनिया घूमना था ही वुड ही वाज इन लव एंड सीकिंग एडवेंचर वो उसके लाइफ में एडवेंचर सीख कर रहा था और जहां पर भी वो जा रहा था ही वाज ऑफरिंग हिज सर्विसेज मतलब अगर वो ऐसे कुछ काम है जो वो कर सकते हैं तो वो उनको कर देते he offered his services to do work in exchange for food to jab wo kuch kaam karke dete the kisi aur ko uske exchange mein use khana ya rehne ka jagah mil jata tha he was a happy monkey and he loved helping people do you think it's an important virtue to help people no yeah, absolutely. absolutely i said one day he passed through the village of zwer where 20 animals lived he saw an old beaver so he walked towards him and said hello mr beaver if i was to do some garden work for you today would you be so kind as to give something for me to eat so he saw ye monkey ne kisko dekha beaver बीवर एक एनिमल है तो जब वो एक विलेज से गुजर रहा था जिसका वो विलेज का नाम क्या था Zwer. और उसके अंदर हाउ मेनी एनिमल्स लिव्ड इन दैट विलेज लाइक अगर मैं आपका गार्डनिंग आज करके दूंगा इन एक्सचेंज उसके बदले में क्या आप मुझे कुछ खाना और रहने के लिए एक जगह दे सकते हो गार्डनिंग एंड फिक्स अप फ्यू थिंग्स अराउंड द हाउस इट वॉज अ लॉन्ग एंड टायरिंग डे फॉर स्प्रिंग्स बच बट एंजॉय दिस डे so springs enjoyed usne kafi maza liya mr beaver ki madad karne mein uska gardening karke diya aur ghar ke chote mote jo kaam tha wo bhi karke diya aur usko kafi maza aaya ye kaam karte hue when springs returned to the house in the evening the whole village had gathered there there was a lot of food put out on the large wooden table and everybody was celebrating as though a hero had come to their village wow what a feeling that would have been to be 
celebrated by so many animals you know when and there is so much food itna khana hai table pe aur aapko ek hero ki tarah mehsoos ho raha ho that would have been amazing right anaya yeah they all had a great time they all had a great time that night it was like a big party there was dancing and lots of food and springs really enjoyed the evening to wahan pe khana tha naach gana ho raha tha aur spring ko bahut maza aaya wo sham ko the following morning when springs was ready to leave the old beaver approached springs with tears in his eyes and said thank you for joining us for dinner please come back whenever you have the time i have two boys around your age who i have not seen in 10 years spending time with you reminded me of my boys mr beaver ko bahut he felt very bad usko bahut dukh hua jab agle din springs wapas ja raha tha aur wo bola tha ki thank you dinner mein aane ke liye aur usko uske aankhon mein aansu kyu aa raha tha kyunki jo ye springs jo hai mr beaver ke do bacche hai aur wo hi same age ke the and wo bachcho ko mr beaver ne 10 year matlab 10 saalon se nahi dekha tha what a sad thing that is springs did not know what to say so he just hugged the beaver like he would just like he would his father and set off on his way with a promise to return one day so springs ko bhi bahut dukh hua mr beaver ko itna dukhi dekhte hue aur usne mr beaver ko zor se gale lagaya जैसे वो अपने खुद के पापा को गले लगा रही और उसको प्रॉमिस किया उन्होंने उनको प्रॉमिस करके बोला कि मैं जरूर एक दिन वापस लौटूंगा स्प्रिंग्स हैड बीन वॉकिंग फॉर सम टाइम एंड वाज टायर्ड तो स्प्रिंग्स चला वो चल चल के चल चल के जा रहा था और वो वापस थक गया ही सॉ टू हाईवे रॉबर्स हु पुश्ड हिम डाउन एंड टुक हिस्स बैग अवे रॉबर्स के picked up his backpack and continued on his journey he started to think about all the good and bad things in the world it was such a bad thing to do right when the robbers came or you know taking snatching away things that is does not belong to you it's such a wrong thing to do it's absolutely wrong but, but thankfully they did not hurt springs वो वो चोर लोग ने स्प्रिंग्स को कुछ नुकसान नहीं पहुंचा तो ये अच्छी बात है तो स्प्रिंग्स सोच रहा था कि दुनिया में कितने सारे अच्छी बातें हैं और कितनी सारी बुरी बातें हैं द रोड वॉज लॉन्ग एंड वाइंडिंग एंड फाइनली लेड हिम टू अ डार्क फॉरेस्ट सो वेन ही वॉज वॉकिंग थ्रू द रोड वॉट हैपन्ड ही केम अक्रॉस अ डार्क फॉरेस्ट घना जंगल के पास आ गया the only way he could continue his journey was to walk through the forest and it was already getting so dark abhi wo raat ke time jungle ke andar se usko jana tha springs walked for more than an hour and then he realized he was lost he decided to climb up a tree to relax and eat some of the bread the villagers had given him suddenly springs heard some voices shouting for help he climbed down from the tree and ran in the direction of the voices were coming i wonder who's looking for help 
in the middle of the jungle at night. Who do you think it would be? Let's read. Might be the rabbits. It could be the robbers? Maybe. Let's Maybe. find out. Maybe it might be the beaver also. It could be the beaver or it could be the villagers. It could be anyone. So let's find out. Springs reach the place the voices were coming from. Springs reach the place the voices were coming from. He saw that the two robbers who had pushed him earlier that day were trapped inside a deep hole in the ground. That was a good guess. So yeah, it was indeed what sure jo unne pareshan kiye the aur bad chhin rahe the, wahi do robbers aafat mein aa gaye the aur ek deep hole mein phas gaye the aur wo log help help chila rahe the aur springs aa gaya. They were both trapped and couldn't get out and were yelling for help. Springs quickly reached into his backpack and remember what he had in his backpack? Yeah. And uh, Ayan, do you remember? Uh, he had a rope. He had some bread and Correct. some like managing things. Correct. So he had a rope. He had bread and some tools. So Chris, what do you think he would have used to save these two robbers inside a deep uh, hole? The rope. The rope. Uh, the springs ne jo rasi hai. The springs ne jo uh, the rope anaya. Do you think this? Uh, what would have he done with the rope? What would the springs do with the rope? And how would he have helped the two people in the hole? He will take his rope out and he will rescue. That's right. He would take his rope out and rescue the two robbers. How? By lowering the rope. Us rope ko. Uh, robbers, jo holes ke andar hai, uske, uh, us, uh, you know, if you would just extend the rope towards them, the robbers would catch on to the rope and they could come up, right? He tied one end of the rope to a tree and threw the other end inside the hole. The robbers both quickly jumped up to the rope to safety. The robbers were amazed that springs had saved them. One robber asked, why did you help us? We pushed you and tried to rob you earlier. Why did you help us? Hamara madad kyu karo gaya? Jab humne aapko nuksaan pochani ki koshish ki aur ab wo sab bhool ke aap humare madad karna chate. Tum aise kyu karo gaya? Why would you do that? Do you think, what do you think is the right thing to do? Not to save the robbers. You think you should have not have saved the robbers? Yeah, because robbers always kick up people. But you can always find the good in your heart to help people when they are in need. Well, actually, except robbers. Okay, but robbers are people too. But then suddenly they were not so then. Okay. Springs replied. There are good people and bad people in the world. The good people do good things and the bad people do bad things. I have decided to be one of the good people. The two robbers were amazed by Spring's reply. Why was they amazed? Because, because Spring's had decided Chris to be a good person. Anaya, why did Spring decide to be a good person or a bad person? Um, because he decided to be a good person or a bad person? Um, a good person. And it is always good to be a good person. Achha insan ho na, hamesha hai achhi baat hai. Springs told the robbers, I have traveled the way. I have traveled far and wide, seen happiness as well as sorrows. Mm. I have met all kinds of people, good, bad, old and young. I have experienced all sorts of bad things. But I have always tried to do only good things. What a wonderful monkey this Mr. Pr Springs was. As Springs was leaving, he gave the two robbers some bread 
with a smile and said, I hope what I have said today will help you realize that there is always a way to live without causing harm to others. So we are seeing how the springs have a good person to be a good person. निश्चय किया और वो दूसरे लोगों और ये जो दो रॉबर्स है उनको भी वो ये सलाह दे रहा है कि अच्छापन का हमेशा जीत होता है और आपको भी अच्छा होना चाहिए So what do you think the moral of the story is here, Ayan? What do you think the moral of the story is? I think the moral of the story is that um, like we have to always be good people no matter what like comes. You must always be, be good. We must always be good. And 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 we must always be good. Chris, why is it important to be a good person? Because, uh, because you you always have to help people because to be strong, uh, uh, like good, amazing, and like you you should be amazed. So it's good to be a you know it's amazing to be a good yeah. person. Anaya, who do you choose to be? You choose to be a good person or a bad person? I think I'll be a good person. You think you'll be a good person? And why do you want to be a good person, Anaya? Yeah. What, what does, does a good, good person, person do? She shares. A good person always shares. Just like the monkey shared his food, his bread with the robbers. Absolutely. So as you can see, we are seeing that we are It's good to share. It's good to be a good person. And it's always good to be a good Thank you for watching with us. And hope you've enjoyed the story the way we have. All right, so we're rearranged ourselves now for the next story about Ginger the giraffe, right? I know you're holding Ginger the giraffe. So let's learn, let's find out what does Ginger the giraffe have to say. Once upon a time, there was a giraffe named Ginger. Hi, Ginger. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Ginger lived in Kenya. Hey, Aya, do you know where Kenya is? It's in Africa. That's right. Kenya is in Africa, a country in Africa. Like all giraffes, Ginger had a long neck and long legs. Giraffe, no? Um, no. Okay, we'll show you a picture right now. Because she was so tall, she was able to eat food from the very top of the trees in the savanna. Wow! So, ginger giraffe, unke li, ginger giraffe ka lamba sa ek gala hai aur lamba sa legs ke wajay se वो जो ट्री के सबसे ऊपर के जो फ्रेश लीव्स है वो खा सकते थे इन एट द सवाना द सवाना इन अफ्रीका इज एन एरिया विद लॉट्स ऑफ ग्रास एंड सम ट्रीज समटाइम्स अ सवाना इज कॉल्ड ग्रासलैंड द अदर एनिमल्स लाइक जीब्रास एंड एंटीलोप्स could not reach where ginger could reach. Yes, Anaya? Yanti, the scary animal. No, two animals which are scary, lion and tiger. Oh, but the lion and tiger has not come here yet. Anaya, we're talking about zebras and antelopes. They're sweet animals. Um, okay. Which, which sweet animals are they, no? They are baby animals. They are, they are baby animals because but, they're shorter. Is that what you're saying? They're but, baby animals. But in their tummy, you no, know, yeah. there will be babies inside. Okay, that's wonderful. Okay, so the other animals like zebras and antelopes could not reach where ginger could reach. Why? Because of the, the long neck and the long 
करेक्ट सो बिकॉज ऑफ जिंजर के लॉन्ग गला और लॉन्ग लेग्स के वजह से जो वो उस जगह जगह पहुंच सकती थी जहां पे दूसरे एनिमल्स पहुंच नहीं पाते थे बट जिंजर ऑलवेज फाउंड फूड शी लव द लीव्स एंड द न्यू बड्स ऑफ द ट्री आई वांट टू नो Well, why is the baby giraffe not eating? The baby giraffe might eat later when it's hungry. Okay. But why can he not reach? They he can reach. But why can the baby one not? Reach? They will reach. <laughs> one day, Ginger was busy eating her favorite leaves along with some other giraffes. It was a bright sunny day, and there was not a cloud in the sky. Clear sky. It had not rained for a long time, so the grass was very dry. सब कुछ सूख गया था अफ्रीका में जैसे कि अफ्रीका में आप जाते हैं बहुत ज़्यादा तेज़ धूप होता है. She heard a noise down at the bottom of her extra long legs. It was her friend. Mickey the monkey. Huh. Mickey was trying to say something, but Ginger couldn't understand what he was saying. He looked very tired. What's wrong? asked Ginger. Ginger was a very kind giraffe and wanted to help everyone. Just then, oh, Ginger was a very kind giraffe and wanted to help everyone. Now, who does Ginger remind us of? Just the previous story we had. Yeah. Mister. The Mister. Mister Beaver. Mister Springs. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. Ginger. So who does he remind us of? Mister Springs from the previous story. Correct. That's the Mickey the monkey. Ginger. Was also a smart giraffe, very smart giraffe. Uh, just like, just like the, uh, Mr. Springs. Springs, yeah, he was smart too. Oh, you're right. He, she knew what was wrong. Mickey couldn't you find. Want to ask me a question. I will ask you a question when it is time to ask you. Okay, Cookie. She knew what was wrong. Mickey. Couldn't find anything to eat, and he was very hungry. How do you do? You're hungry, Anaya. You're very hungry. Are you hungry now? No, she's not. Ginger nibbled some fresh, tender leaves and buds from the top of the tree where she was eating. She dropped some leaves and buds to the ground. And who was sitting on the floor, Anaya? Which animal? animal? The monkey. What is the name of the monkey? Mickey. Mickey the monkey. नीचे रुका था और ginger the giraffe ने ginger the giraffe ने कुछ tree के top में से जो नए पत्ते हैं और जो छोटे-छोटे buds हैं वो ज़मीन पे गिराया किसके लिए? Mickey the monkey के लिए. She dropped. some of the leaves and buds to the ground near where mickey was then she nudged him a little you know what's nudge no this is called nudging where you nudge nudged him a little with the hoof at the bottom of one of her long legs so as we know ginger the giraffe had... so yeah you obviously didn't have elbows like i do so with the uh the leg the foot She nudged, I have right? Baby elbows. Yes, you have baby elbows. That's right. She nudged him a little with the hoof at the bottom of one of her very long legs. Wake up, Mickey! Said Ginger. Wake up! I found something for you to eat. Slowly, Mickey sat up, up and ate Ginger. a little. <laughs> Thank you, Ginger. Said Mickey. There, see, you see in the picture how Ginger is giving something and to why eat. Why is Ginger tall? 
because he's a giraffe and giraffes have long legs. Yes, Chris. So, so do so do uh, do uh, do giraffes like uh, like eating so, leaves all the time, but grass? Uh, the the long neck of the giraffe makes it easier for the giraffe to eat leaves off the trees than bend down to the grass and eat. Don't you think? That's why the giraffe eats leaves from the top of the tree because it's very difficult to bring his long neck all the way down and eat the grass. But he leaves the grass for the zebras and the antelopes. So does that mean that the uh, giraffe is a herbivore? Yes, the giraffe is a herbivore animal. Yes, Anaya? Why do giraffes always have brown brown spots? Um, I think that's the way God made giraffes with brown spots. Yeah. Just the way he made zebras with black stripes. I seen a, a zebra no, which has black stripes. That's right. Even I've seen one too. Do you want to read what happened to uh, Mickey the monkey and Ginger the giraffe? Yes. Okay. So, so after a while, after a while, when Mickey was feeling better, Ginger asked him, you have to show me the picture. What's happened, Mickey? Why are you so hungry? Why can't you find anything to eat? Mickey said, it hasn't rained for so long and now there's no more food. <laughs> Anaya, stop it. You can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'll show you the picture, but let me finish what I have to read, okay, Anaya? Okay. So, after a while, when Mickey was feeling better, J Anaya, here, here, look at this camera, okay? So, after a while, when Mickey was feeling better, Ginger asked him, What's happened, Mickey? Why are you so hungry? Why can't you find anything to eat? Mickey said, It hasn't rained for so long. And now there's no more food. That's not good, said Ginger. What's happening with the other animals? No one knows what to do, answered Mickey. All the zebras and the antelopes and the elephants are getting worried about the dry grass. Some of them are thinking about leaving the savanna and trying to reach the jungle so jo grass hai wo sare dry up ho gaye because bahut waqt se barish nahi hui hai and uske wajah se jaise aap dekh rahe the monkeys the zebras the antelopes the elephants ye sab pareshan hai ki hum kya karenge agar sare jo grass hai wo dry up hue to un log nahi dry grass nahi kha sakte hai and they are trying to go towards the jungle anaya that's a long trip said Ginger. Are you going to go with them? Ah, oh, look at the picture. Ginger's talking with Mickey now. And see, everywhere there's dry grass. And there's only tall trees, but tall trees with little leaves that can be only reached by the giraffes. I don't know, answered Mickey. What do you think we should do? Ginger thought for a while. And then suddenly, he, she had a good idea. We should go talk to Leo the lion. Leo? Yeah. He is the smartest animal in the savanna. He's the king. He is the king. The lion is the king of the jungle and of the savanna. And Ginger or Mickey ne this ye decide kya ki ye problem jo sab face kar rahe, उसको कौन सॉल्व कर कर सक कौन सॉल्व कर सकते लियो द लायन ही इज द बिकॉज ही इज द स्मार्टेस्ट एनिमल वो सबसे स्मार्ट है यस क्रिस ऑल लायंस आर लाइक अ फ्यूरियस एनिमल दे आर फ्यूरियस एनिमल्स क्रिस दैट्स राइट एंड एवरी ऑल एंड लायंस इज लाइक मीट ओनली द लायंस ईट्स मीट यस मिकी वाज टू टायर्ड टू वॉक so ginger invited him 
to write on our back. Blanket. Yes, banana. I get water from bottles. <laughs> I know you drink water from bottles, yeah. <laughs> okay, so you know what happened, Anaya? Mickey <laughs> was too tired. Mickey the monkey. Anaya, look at me. Mickey the monkey was too tired. And so, you know what Ginger the giraffe did? You remember at the start of the story, we heard that uh, he he's, he likes to help people. No. So he decided, yeah, well, we read that he Ginger the giraffe liked to help people. And he decided, he decided that Mickey the monkey, ko, he'll give a ride for him on the back of the giraffe. You know how you go piggyback riding? So the Ginger the giraffe decided to give Mickey the monkey a ride on its back. Hold on to my neck, said Ginger. There's a lot to hold on to because it was a long neck. Ginger laughed. You're right. I've got the longest neck in Africa. So they started their journey across to the other side of the savannah to look for... Who were they looking for, Chris? Leo the lion. They were looking for Leo the lion. That's right. Hey, look how he's giving him a ride at the back. Yes, Ayan. So, did, did, at the start of the ride was um, the monkey monkey holding at the top and then at the end of the ride he was holding at the bottom. So that. Excuse me? Oh, he's not right. Excuse me? Like when you started... It's a, it's a long way to go, right? Uh, so, okay, yes, Chris. Uh, so, so then, did, did Mickey have to like go up the head because it took so long that, that accidentally they might go up the head? <laughs> we'll find out. out what happened. So, we have Mickey the monkey here and we have Ginger the giraffe. So, he's giving him a piggyback ride on its back, like this. <laughs> They're trying to go. All right. So, Ginger and Mickey were in luck. Leo was sitting up on a rock, and he was really easy to see as they walked through the grass. Ooh. Hi, Leo! They both shouted. Leo had been napping and was a and was a little grumpy when they woke him up. So Leo the lion so raha or jab wo usko uthaye, to wo thoda chid gaya. He was a little grumpy. Le but he was polite. Who was polite? Leo. Leo the lion was polite. It's good to be polite. And he said, "Hello, Ginger. Hello, Mickey. Why did you walk?" The whole way across the savanna just to wake me up? But he was joking. He had a smile on his face. Mickey says that there is no food left on the savanna because it's been so dry, said Ginger. Do you have any ideas? Hmm. Liu thought for a while. It's always important to think before you speak. So the same way, Leo ne bhi... Kuch jawab dene se pehle, Leo ne socha. He said, there's nothing we can do about the rain. It will come soon. But we can't be sure as to when it will arrive. When the rain comes, all the plants will grow again. And there will be lots of food for everybody. He thought a little longer. So, we have seen that Leo has said that if the rain is not going to happen, then we will not do But if the rain is going to happen, then we will not do anything for everyone. The only thing I can think of is for everyone to move closer to the forest. He continued. There will be more things to eat there. But I know it's a long trip and it will not be very easy. It might take days to get there. 
तो यहाँ पे हम देख रहे हैं कि कैसे लियो द लायन ने ऐसे सलाह दिया कि सारे एनिमल्स को बोलो कि जंगल के और करीब और और पास आ जाए जिंजर एंड मिकी लुक्ड एट ईच अदर एंड देन लुक्ड बैक एट लियो थैंक यू लियो सेड जिंजर इट्स प्रॉबेबली बेस्ट इफ यू ऑल ट्राई to get closer to the jungle they said goodbye and they walked back across the savanna now they needed to gather all the animals together to start the long journey ginger didn't need to go along because she had plenty of food in her high trees so we saw in the picture how there was you know the top of the trees was still had green leaves on them so ginger didn't have to go closer to the jungle but all the un- other animals who had shorter legs and shorter necks had to go closer to the jungle but she was a good friend and wanted to help as much as she could they walked towards her favorite trees and guess what she and mickey saw we think she saw maybe a leo horse switched off so they walked towards her favorite trees and guess what she and mickey saw all the animals were already gathered there and waiting for ginger and mickey why are you all here asked ginger eddy the eagle told us that you are taking us to the edge of the jungle so So that's a new character that has come into the story. So this is an eagle, and his name is Eddie. So Eddie the eagle saw Eddie the eagle ne dekha ki Ginger the giraffe or Mickey the monkey already gaye the Leo the lion se baat karne ke liye, right? Question. Okay. So Eddie the eagle, humne dekha ki Eddie the eagle ne dekha. उसके ईगल हैज एज यू नो वेरी शार्प वेरी शार्प आई साइड सो उसने देखा कि दूर जिंजर जिराफ और मिकी द मंकी गए थे लियो द लाइन से मिलने को सो ही केम ही क्विकली फ्लू बैक टू ऑल द एनिमल्स एंड टोल दम ऑल टू गैदर अराउंड एंड सो एट ईगल टोल्ड अस दैट यू आर टेकिंग अस टू द एज ऑफ द जंगल सेट वन ऑफ द जीब्रस How did he know? Asked Mickey. He heard you talking to Leo," said one of the antelopes. "So you've all decided to try to walk to go- together to the jungle?" asked Ginger. "Yes," they all answered. "If you will help us to get there," added one of the elephants. "Of course I'll help," said Ginger. "I'm your friend." and that's what friends do right they yeah. always help each other it's very important yeah, to help sorry. each other do you think it's important to help each other and i yeah. absolutely important to help each other so they started on their big journey across the savanna to the jungle the sun was so hot and there was no food and no place to get a drink of water and then they heard it it was a thunder thunder they all shouted thunder was very scary to the animals of the savanna can you guess why because maybe may, may because because they have lightning and that's scary could it be scary because of the lightning yes. and the loud voice of the thunder so and then it will rain and then it will rain that's right and i so let's find out why they were so guess why fire sometimes the lightning hits the dry grass and the whole savanna catches fire that everyone had to run and that is exactly what happened the whole there was fire in the savanna fire they shouted they could smell it and now they could see it the fire was coming towards them look you see in the picture how the fire is coming towards all the animals ginger had to 
think really fast because he was so tall she could see further than any other animals she stretched her long neck up as far as she could let's stretch this long leg oh this is a short neck here so she stretched her long neck now she could see a place where there was no fire quick she said everyone run this way all of the animals followed her and ran as fast as they could soon they were out of danger they stopped and gathered together one more time is everyone here ginger asked she wanted to make sure they were all safe all the animals looked around they were all there to humne dekha ki kaise badal gaza aur sab ek sare animals ekdam se dar gaye aur wo kyu dare the kyunki hamesha se jab badal garajta hai unko ye experience raha hai ki there has been fire so there has been fire aur actual mein sachmuch mein wo jo dry grass hai वहां पे आग That's लग गया था दैट इज वेरी स्केरी जब आग लगता है इट इज रियली स्केरी और बिकॉज ऑफ जिंजर्स लॉन्ग नेक वो दूर दूसरे एनिमल से ज्यादा दूर तक देख सकता है और उन्होंने जिंजर ने देखा कि किस डायरेक्शन पे देर वॉज नो फायर एंड सारे दूसरे एनिमल्स को सुरक्षित करने के लिए उन्होंने बोला इस तरफ से भागो एंड ऑल द एनिमल्स वो सेफ सारे एनिमल सुरक्षित थे एंड देन the most wonderful thing happened i felt a drop said a zebra me too said an antelope it was rain finally it was raining in the savanna everyone was very happy it started to rain a little more and then a little more the rain put out the fires so they didn't have to run and the rain filled their watering holes and made the plants grow again so they didn't have to make that long trip to the edge of the jungle everyone would soon have enough food and water so ginger the giraffe went back to her favorite tree and continued to munch on the leaves and buds how wonderful don't you think Yes. I That's saw, the end. I saw. That's right. You see how it's raining in the savannas and everything that was dry before is now green because the rain it helps plants grow and that's we see how important it is. Look, I see. That's right. You see how so you see all the animals I and ginger there are. I see them. Yes, you see ginger. That's right. I see ginger. Did you enjoy that story? so you see how uh, ginger the giraffe was also a superhero in this for saving everyone so yes. we had two stories about superheroes doing the right thing helping each other and saving other people when they are in trouble what, what a wonderful thing to do with this yes chris do, uh, do you know in that in mr in mr singh mm mm-hmm. He was also big with a superhero. That's right. He was also I am. Two stories. Both the stories had, had superheroes. Had the had the the people, the characters in the story being superheroes and being super, super helpful. helpful. So, so which are the qualities, Ayan, that you think that you should have in order to be uh something like Ginger? And maybe a combination of Ginger and Mr. Springs. Maybe um to be helpful. To be helpful, feet and, and also yeah, um, and also to have patience. Like so, you need to have yeah. patience. Yeah. And he was a quick yeah. thinker as yeah. well, and he was smart. So, how we can see that how uh, through stories we are t- teaching the kids. Stop. So we're seeing that how through stories we are teaching the kids to. That tiger story. and that I'll tell you so we're saying that how through stories we are teaching kids the values and virtues and uh, the important traits that you need to have as a person the important traits that you need to have as a person to do good to see good to hear good 
and to always help each other and be smart tonight don't you agree all right thank you so much for joining us tonight and thank you so much for joining us and i hope you enjoyed this story and do let us know through your comments if there are any other special um, learnings agar kuch uh, special uh, learnings ya seek aapko mila hai please comment and let us know so as of now bye everyone say bye bye uh so we will see you back tomorrow at 4 o'clock for two more stories and get ready <laughs>